Hi, this is Kit Welchlin and welcome to Welchlin.com. Today's video blog is on leadership. The question is, what mistakes are made when discussing accountability? Hey Kit, I've been practicing that conversation model for accountability discussions. I'm not sure if I'm, uh, I've got the right balance for those five steps. I, I want to do it well. I don't want to make a mistake and a uh, little help please. <laughs> As you recall, the process of conversation has five steps. Opening, feed forward, business, feedback, and closing. The opening and closing are usually about the same length as are feed forward and feedback. The business is the longest part of the conversation. When these relative lengths are severely distorted, people quickly get the feeling that something is wrong. For example, when someone uses a long feed forward or too short of an opening, people suspect that what will follow is extremely serious. Consider the following violations and how they can damage an entire conversation. Using openings that are insensitive, saying something like, wow, did you just roll out of bed? Using overly long feed forwards make people feel or wonder whether you will ever get to the business or something must be really wrong. Omitting feed forward leads people to be somewhat anxious or uncertain or see you as insensitive or uncaring. Doing business without the normally expected greeting is when you go to your coworker and they begin the conversation by saying, what's wrong? Omitting feedback, which leads you to wonder whether the other person heard what you said or even cared about it. Omitting an appropriate closing, which makes people wonder whether you are disturbed or angry. Such violations may have significant consequences if we're not mindful of these rules. People might see us as being aggressive, stuffy, or pushy, and almost immediately dislike us or put a negative cloud over the future interactions. I certainly don't want a negative cloud over my future interactions with you or anyone else. I never realized that these steps in the wrong proportion could create such circumstances. Thank you for watching this video blog on leadership. So the question was, what mistakes are made discussing accountability? Not being balanced in our approach. If you need assistance, contact me at kidatwelchland.com and I will deliver a presentation that will guide you in having difficult discussions during stressful situations. Check back to Welchland.com every Monday for a new video blog.